So this question is a translate word problem, which really I, I can tell before reading it just because I know that it's longer than three lines, right? Uh, we also have a, an equation provided, right? So anytime an equation is provided in a question, I like to rewrite that equation for myself. So h equals negative 4.9 t squared plus 25t. And then due to the fact that it's a word problem, I like to read each sentence at a time, making sure to stop and write down any relevant information, especially quantitative information. So let's get started. So this question starts out by saying the equation above expresses the approximate height h. All right, so I know that that's my height in meters of a ball t seconds after it is launched vertically upward from the ground. So I know that t is time, All right? So I have two t's uh, with an initial velocity of 25 meters per second. So I'm not sure if that's useful, but I'm gonna write v equals 25 meters per second. After approximately how many seconds will the ball hit the ground? Okay, we'll hit the ground, right? So basically, how much time does it take for the ball to hit the ground? Um, so what do I know about the ball hitting the ground? Well, I know that in order for the ball to hit the ground, that means that my height or the height of the ball would have to be zero. Okay, and that's really the key to answering this question. Because now I can just rewrite the equation as 0 equals negative 4.9 t squared plus 25 t. And I can do some uh, factoring here. So 0 equals t, parentheses, negative 4.9 t plus 25 which means that either t is equal to zero, which makes sense, right? The ball is at its lowest point at the start, at the starting point, right? Before it's launched up or negative 4.9 t plus 25 is equal to zero. This is gonna be the one that gets us our answer. So I can subtract 25 from both sides, which would leave me with negative 4.9 t equals negative 25 divide both sides by negative 4.9. And I basically get T is, I'll just say approximately, but it's super close. T is equal to five, five seconds. And therefore my final answer here is D.